Hi everyone, welcome back to the 2-Bit Crypto channel. My name is Mike. In this video, we're taking a look at a confirmed 700 trillion token buyback from BitMart. What will it do to the price? What does it mean for reflections and more? So if that's something you like the sound of, make sure you are subscribed to this channel. Give it a thumbs up. Let's jump straight into it. So we take a quick look at the price for Saitama. We are up 1.53%. We are seeing some moves out of some other tokens into Saitama, hopefully anticipating some good news. Total market cap unverified, uh, obviously just over the $2 billion mark. Volume is down, but we are seeing that starting to ramp up, but down 32%. So I'd expect to see that kind of motor over the next couple of days. Price at the 4552, which again is uh, steady, but is increasing. So look, the main thing I want to talk about is this from Ross, and it was from the AMA the other night. So full app bitmart exchange hack buyback explained via Ross how it will be done and what's next for you. The SATA Wolfpack holder 100% confirmed within the interview, and now it's time to load up in our personal view. So again, this is not financial advice, and I am not a financial advisor. However, I'm not going to play the clip, but Russ talked about Bitmart and that they would own and they would make sure that anyone who did own Saitama tokens would be repaid in Saitama. So that's huge. 700 trillion token buyback would completely and utterly skyrocket the price. And obviously there's a risk there that people will start to cash out and it will just kind of fluctuate and completely disrupt the market. But I do want to context how much that really is. And I guess for me, this shows some real confidence from a big exchange like Bitmart. First and foremost, that they are going to uh, pay back everyone with these tokens. But secondly, that is a huge amount to buy back, a huge amount to buy back. So they clearly are really bullish on this project as well. And they clearly, or they might know something we don't. But let me just context it with a couple of these. So here's the total holders. You can see they're at 275,953. So on the journey to 300 excuse me, 300,000 holders. When we look at some of the addresses, you can see we've burnt 56%, uh, so $2.5 billion worth of Saitama has already been burnt. So then let's take a look at some of the holders. So this wallet is the wallet of Poloniex. So we know that Poloniex is our top three central exchange that trades Saitama. And you can see in this wallet, there is 134 trillion tokens so it's nearly a sixth of what BitMart want to buy back, just to give you an idea. This wallet is gate.io, so not quite as big um, in terms of volume, but our second biggest market that we have for Sitama, that currently holds 9 trillion tokens. So then you start to think about this 700 trillion token buyback is absolutely gigantic. Absolutely gigantic. And I think they're going to have to move pretty quickly on this because all of a sudden 700 trillion tokens is going to start to increase in price and it's certainly going to be a big amount of tokens to buy back. To give you an idea of, I guess, the actual gravity of that, USD, you're talking about $33 million for Bitmart to hack that. Now, look, we know the total amount they lost was about 150 million, but 32 million, that's nearly 7,500 Ethereum going into Saitama. So clearly they're going to have to be really structured how they do this, but the longer they wait, the more it's going to cost. So I think we're going to see this move quite quickly, but I think it's going to be very strategic how they move it. Right now, they're not in the top 1,000 holders, so they haven't even started this purchase uh, yet. So I think we're going to have to stay really close to Etherscan and see when this starts to move. But I would expect some real bullish movement on the price of Saitama as BitMart starts to buy back in. Let me know in the comments down below what are you doing? What's your strategy? We know this is coming. It's been 100% confirmed that BitMart are going to buy back $32 million worth, 7,500 ETH. What's your strategy to make sure that you are maximizing what you can? Look, in terms of reflections, it's going to be amazing for the community and, you know, really bullish move from BitMart. One of the other things I did want to just talk around is the new arrivals on the Saitama official store. Some of this stuff looks pretty cool. Um, and I guess one of the things I was going to ask the community out there, and you know, we've gone over that thousand subscribers. When do you make merch for your YouTube channel? That's my question to you guys. So look, drop it in the comments down below. But look, some of this merch is pretty sick. I like some of this, this kind of Saitama merch. You never know, we can see a 2-bit crypto hat or a 2-bit crypto t-shirt. I definitely wouldn't charge $26 for it, though. Let me tell you, that'd be much, much cheaper than that. So that's what I've got for you on Saitama. Look, pretty exciting news. Again, this is like 
We know this is coming. It's going to be a huge move on the price. I think we've just got to be really careful how we do it. People are moving back into Saitama. There's been some big movements back in there. 9, 10, 11 ETH going back in. So I think some clear movement and some clear desire from some holders to make sure. Again, drop in the comments what you think, and I'm going to see you guys in the next one.